I've been a driver for 23 years. You have to be strong, so does the vehicle. It shouldn't let you down. So you have to pick the right parts, that's the secret. Then the ride will be smooth and you won't be distracted. That is why air springs are critical. If your air springs are robust, you won't feel a thing and your cargo will be safe. Well, I've seen some really bad roads with potholes and rough patches. Sometimes we're on the road for days under ever-changing circumstances. Day and night, cold or heat. Good air springs shouldn't let you down in both hot and cold weather. Your air springs should be sturdy. You have to hear that sound. Without this sound, most rides would be quite exhausting and above all, very dangerous. This sound, which should be familiar to anyone who travels by bus, comes from air springs, the load-bearing component of pneumatic suspension systems. And this is the story of air springs. Springs are systems placed between the vehicle's body and wheels, designed to absorb vibrations caused by the road surfaces. In addition to buses, they are also used in trucks, trailers, tractors, and trains. They are designed to transfer steering and braking forces to the body and to ensure safe maneuvering without the wheels losing contact with the road. Suspension springs extend the life of the vehicle. They extend tire life. They extend maintenance cycles. They reduce the movement and vibration in the cargo. Cabin springs prevent driver fatigue and ensure a safer journey. Suspensions underwent many changes before they reached their present form and functionality. Engineers have tried many different kinds of springs for suspending vehicles on their axles. There were buggy-style elliptical leaf springs, more recent semi-elliptic spring stacks, coil springs, steel torsion springs, rubber in compression, rubber in shear, combinations of rubber and helical springs, and pneumatic springs that float the vehicle on a cushion of air. The design process of the air springs took more than 100 years. Due to their complex structure, advanced technologies were needed to produce the springs in required specifications. Thanks to the ever-evolving technology, air springs today are much more powerful and they are able to perform even in the most challenging conditions. With expertise dating back to 1950, Sampa produces parts for heavy-duty vehicles. It offers 30,000 kinds of products to 138 countries from its integrated facilities with nine factories and offices, subsidiaries, and warehouses located in different parts of the world. Air springs are Sampa's pride and joy.
We produce four different kinds of air springs, cab air springs, roll air springs, convoluted air springs, and suspension air springs. These are widely used in buses, heavy duty vehicles, and heavy machinery, as well as light commercial vehicles. We have four main production processes for the springs. Our first process is core fabric cutting, forming, vulcanization, and assembly. Sampa has an integrated plant with a global production structure. We have nine different factories including metal sheet manufacturing, plastic injection, machining, air spring manufacturing, and coating. Since we produce all the semi-products used in air springs, we have a better command of the processes, and we deliver products to our customers on time. We align our production with customer deadlines. Sampa's expertise in air springs derives from years of experience and the extensive work carried out at camp. Sampa's award-winning R&D center equipped with state-of-the-art technology. So how does camp make a difference in spring production? Most suspension manufacturers on the market believe that we should obtain a version of the product from any source, recreate the product exactly, and work on those copies. The products they produce are sold as physically equivalent products that can fulfill the functionalities of the original products. But we do not only recreate the same suspension air springs in terms of geometric appearance or function. Our aim is to also maintain the quality, product life, and added comfort, or enhance them based on customer request. Our labs are very well equipped. Thanks to our equipment, we can perform reverse engineering. We start with the geometrical analysis of the product. The scanning of the product, that is, obtaining the stereographic data. Starting with 3D imaging. It continues with reverse engineering in order to identify the function of each component. This analysis allows us to define the product specifications from another company's product through reverse engineering. When you want to buy an ordinary rubber product, you may find many alternative sellers in the market. But if you're looking for certain rubber specifications, then you need a vendor to detail all active ingredients one by one, like a medical formula. This is the first asset that differentiates Sampa from other companies. Sampa Automotive's R&D center, CAMP, consists of five units. At this facility, 110 scientists work to perfect the manufacturing of air springs. The air spring is a composite product made of several different materials. The final product is a suspension element containing cord fabric and several types of rubber. There are alternative materials used for the layer of cord fabric such as polyamide, polyester, and aramid. For the rubber compost, specific types of rubber are used on certain areas of the layer. In total, the air spring rubber has three layers, including folded cord fabric between two linings. We're talking about the pre-vulcanization manufacturing process here. The central cord fabric forms the skeleton, rubber dough is on top of it, and the lining dough covers them all. They're bonded together with vulcanization that produces the layered cord fabric structure of the air springs. Most good companies develop their own rubber formula, at least the companies with good R&D capabilities. Sampa has its own formulas for both lining and coating. These formulas constantly evolve. Therefore, there are some differences between the current formulas and the earlier ones from many years ago. These differences are visible in the enhanced dynamic performance of the finished product. Compared to the OEMs that we see as competitors in the market, we have formulas and air springs with similar or even better results. Patents published in the spare parts industry end up as products on the market in five to seven years. At Sampa, we monitor these patents very closely and we are able to launch air spring projects today that will be released in the next five years. We can identify the subjects of our projects. Our current air springs projects are usually for the air springs to be released five years from now. Take sensors, for instance. We initiated a project for cab air springs with an integrated ceramic leveling valve. 
We started the project in 2014 and finalized it in 2016. As a result of the project, we had a new product and a European patent application. Thanks to these patents, we are the second company in the world to use ceramic technology in cab air springs with an integrated leveling valve and the first and only company in the aftermarket. We were able to produce this product thanks to the technical information obtained from the patents. The most important component of the air spring is the rubber, and the quality and strength of the rubber is directly related to its formulation. It's a big advantage for a company to have in-house R&D capabilities and to develop its own rubber compound. It's a real privilege to be able to carry out tests related to the rubber, to perform dynamic tests for the finished air springs that you produced using this compound, and to position yourself against other competitors in the market. In addition to rubber, cabin and suspension air springs consist of different parts called plates and bumper in the upper and lower parts. There are versions with a piston which can be made of plastic, metal, or vulcanized rubber. Pistons also affect the performance of the springs. Sampa produces its own metal components as well as rubber and plastic. The pistons and top and bottom plates produced in the sheet metal factory are brought to surface treatment for coating. We have a fully automated surface treatment factory with 44 coating baths, 45 tons of which are alkaline zinc coating baths and 15 tons are zinc nickel coating baths. The pre-treatment processes prior to coating are surface cleaning, degreasing, and preparation for coating. Then the products are coated. After that, there is coloring and additional processes to increase coating performance. We have 12 parking stations. The products arrive at the parking station after these processes and they are collected by the operator. Quality is a must for Sampa products. To meet the expectations of the customers in the market, the Sampa team implements quality control at every step of air spring production. There was something that surprised me quite a lot. We had purchased 3,000 springs from northern Russia. Despite the weather conditions, we experienced no problems at all. Their durability was astonishing, and we were very pleased. This is something we highly respect. Quality is a matter of perception. It basically means fulfilling customer expectations. Today, any company in the world with resources can buy the latest technological equipment, but only certain companies have the capacity to manage know-how. Although the same equipment can be used by anyone, so this is actually a strategic development map. Sampa is proud to integrate eight quality management systems and is certified by international independent organizations. All of these systems are structured to meet customer expectations, which is our definition of quality. In particular, IATF, or 16949 for short, requires a series of synchronous control activities in manufacturing. In this regard, we implement a series of test protocols to address customer expectations and benchmark data of competitors in the products we both design from scratch or produce using reverse engineering. This begins with raw material entering the company. Each operating step, including the interim controls and details such as machine and heat parameters, length of cord fabric or temperature parameters and pressure values during the vulcanization process of the product. The final product is released after managing and controlling all these processes. Sampas operates at a large scale, so we can get the best quality at the right price. SAP is of great help in managing costs. We are able to improve processes and maximize efficiency. The fact that Sampa produces air springs exactly like the originals keeps Sampa ahead of the game and gives Sampa a head start. For example, the shape of the plates. 
all of them serve a purpose during assembly. Since Sampa produces exactly like the original, it makes the assembly easier for the mechanics. This is one of the assets that strengthens our sales policy. We observe and monitor rapid improvements in the price policy too. Uh, for us as a salesman that you have uh, really, you reached the point uh, between price and quality. So for us it's, it's really important to sell to our customers products uh, which are in good price. Better quality than most of popular uh, brands uh, which are right now on the, the market here. Yeah? So you have it. <laughs> In the production of air springs, numerous tests are carried out during the R&D phase, including during the raw metal procurement and production process, as well as on the end product. In our material laboratory, we have devices for the characterization of metal, plastic, polymer, or even composite ceramic materials. Here, we characterize the reference product, determine its contents, run the control tests at every step from the raw materials to the material used in the end product and assure the proper selection of materials. Of course, every component undergoes many detailed tests. We can classify these tests as thermal characterization, mechanical tests, and static and dynamic tests. Air springs must be resistant to harsh road and weather conditions. In addition to rubber, the desired durability of the metal components prolongs the life of the air springs. We have two salt testing devices in our laboratory. One is the salt spray testing device and the other is the cyclic corrosion testing chamber. Uh, in our salt testing device, we prepare a 5% salt solution and spray the salt water on the part. In the other cabinet, we create different atmospheric conditions. For example, a temperature difference test from below 40 to over 70 degrees Celsius. The rain test, the acid test, Considering that Sampa springs are used in 138 countries, producing suitable products for any geographical condition is a must. Why are the tests performed in the cyclic corrosion testing chamber so important? Because the performance of parts of a vehicle operating in cold weather conditions may not be the same as those operating in hot weather conditions. Uh, therefore, we observe the durability of the part by creating different temperatures and weather conditions. We determine how long the parts last under certain conditions. For example, a part that lasts for 200 hours in cold weather may last for 300 hours in hot weather. Thus, we can also discover changing effects of weather conditions on the parts. So what makes Sampa and Sampa Air Springs so special? All of our production lines are designed and installed in accordance with a single quality management system. And they operate accordingly. Therefore, we do not classify our products as best quality or second best quality. There can be no such classification. We continuously monitor the products available in the market, including other equivalent products of our competitors. And we have one thing they do not have, longevity. There's no other company in the aftermarket that has proven product life by testing the product in so many conditions. What makes Sampa unique is that it has a very large machinery infrastructure and a strong engineering and R&D team. At the same time, it aims to provide customer service by providing the best quality and strategies and managing almost all processes internally. Our patent research provides us very technical and detailed information about our products. Thanks to that information, we can see the details that improve the life and quality of our products, the secrets and small details of the product, and we improve on these points. These efforts pay back in the form of durability and quality of our products. Sampa uses steam and nitrogen technology for the vulcanization of the springs. In addition, we use our own custom-built machinery. This distinguishes us from our competitors. Sampa's future plans and investments for springs are growing exponentially. 
we're planning to drastically increase our springs production. And so we have ongoing investments. There are a number of confirmed agreements, both in OEM and aftermarket. And soon, we'll be producing five million springs annually. The R&D Center, CAMP, which was established with an investment of $10 million and continues to grow with annual investments, has led to new market opportunities. Sampa operates in OEM as well as the aftermarket industry. Air springs are the leading original parts designed to be fitted on the vehicles of the world's largest brands on the production line. Sampa has a very young and dynamic team, and OEM has a young and dynamic structure. This is one of the main reasons that Sampa identifies with OEM. They always expect you to be dynamic. They want you to respond quickly to any requests. They expect you to have available technical staff and want to communicate with people who are qualified to address their dynamic needs. Our technical experience, our infrastructure, and our production site makes us attractive in this sense. The biggest proof that we are fast and dynamic is the Q1 process, which we completed in seven months. Ford Otisan reported that the process usually lasts approximately two years, and so far, only two companies have completed it in seven months. One was a supplier in the USA, and the other is Sampa. Our team's commitment, in addition to our structure, helped to accelerate this process. Everyone at the company was motivated by team spirit to get Q1 and provided all their support. This was the biggest factor that helped Sampa to complete this process so quickly. Sampa always demonstrates such commitment. This is one of our key strengths. Russia is a very large country. There are thousands of kilometers of roads from the east to the west. Russia has 11 different time zones and many different climatic regions. For example, there are times with plus 50 degrees Celsius in cold Siberia, where the average temperature is minus 50 degrees Celsius. Therefore, the transportation companies we work with need to be sure that the products they purchase will not break down midway and the drivers will not have to do maintenance work on the road. So quality is an important factor for us and we choose Sampa as our supplier. One of the most critical parts is the air springs. It's essential that the air springs do not cause any trouble to the driver during the journey. For all these years we've been working with Sampa, we've received very few reclamation demands about Sampa air springs. I don't think that Sampa branded products would cause any quality or price-related problems to customers. Until now, we've received no complaints regarding Sampa. We believe that Sampa air springs earn their place in the aftermarket. Your air springs should be sturdy. You have to hear that sound.